I'm Andy Hood. I'm here at the National Care Awards Judging Day. Um, I've been shortlisted the finalist for Special Needs Manager for when we work with Tease Alive. So Andy, you are the manager of Tease Alive, so tell us about that service and what makes it special. Um, the difference that makes in for Tease Alive is that it's a, you know, like being known as a life service, we offer employment, education and leisure opportunities. The service is very bespoke, it's run by the people we support. We don't dictate what they do, they dictate us what they want to do on a day-to-day -day basis and we will implement that with the, with the help of them. And one of the most um, special things about Tears Alive is that you've got a really thriving partnership with Middlesbrough Football yeah. Club. So tell us a little bit about what Middlesbrough Football Club have brought to Tears Alive. Um, just a fantastic partnership, you know, like the, the work that they've been doing not only with the, you know, with the lads but obviously with the staff as well, it's just absolutely been first class. Um, communication skills, you know, even just, you know, people interacting together it's it, it just it's given the gives given the lads you know just a, a great sense of well-being and a great sense of achievement and just you know basic skills you know just you know communicating with each other um you know just listen to each other and things you know it just it comes down to that you know but also seeing that if you have goals and you have aspirations and you work really really hard it's always an opportunity for you to do something Give us some examples of some of the activities people at Tears Alive get involved in. Oh, you name it, you, you name it, we do it, you know, um, we offer our woodwork group, gardening, drama, group, uh, performing arts group, ICT group, a newsletter group, um, football group, a men's group, a women's group, you know, this it, it's basically, you know, it's very much dictated by the people we support um, and about what skills they want to achieve, you know, we have cooking groups, so if they want, you know, if they would like to, you know, make somebody a birthday cake for it as a special Present as a special gift for the, for the parents or anything like that, you know, we'll hopefully give them the basic skills that they can go away and do that at home. Um, but if they really want to learn, you know, if they've got an objective that they would like to get a job, we'll find out what job they would like to do, we'll find out what skills that's required by that and we'll, you know, access courses for them. So it's really, really, you know, it's really wide ranging and very, very run by the, much run by the people we support. Brilliant. And finally, Andy, tell us um, how does it feel to be shortlisted for this prestigious award? Um, I'm, I'm absolutely gobsmacked. I'm speechless, you know, it's, it's you know, it's very much a team effort, a team's alive, a team's alive sorry. Um, you know, it's, it's, I'm very, very fortunate to be in the position that I'm at, but, I, you know, I, I wouldn't be in, in the position I'm at without the, without the support by not only the staff team but by the seniors and also you know by community integrated care you know the the, the, the doors and the opportunity that's been I've been passed to has just been fantastic and like I said I, I just I'm, I'm very very proud and very privileged to you know be a service leader at Taser Life. Congratulations Andy. Thank you.